We're back 7.30. It's a Friday morning, September the 30th, 2022. Ian now pounding the coast of South Carolina, Category 1. It regained hurricane strength overnight. You are looking at uh, live conditions at Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. A lot of folks there bracing for it. Um, waiting to see when that will arrive, supposedly around 2 o'clock. Yeah, yeah, that was the yeah. Grand Strand there. Yeah. Look at the Grand Strand. Yeah, thankfully the hurricane is not as strong as it was when it crashed into Florida, but high winds, heavy rain, and flooding are major concerns. NBC's Kathy Park is mm -hmm. in Charleston for us this morning. Kathy, what are conditions like? Hey, Savannah, good morning to you. A Hurricane Ian is expected to make landfall in the next couple of hours, but as you can see, we're already feeling the impacts of this massive storm. We get, we're getting slammed with heavy bands of rain, intense wind gusts, and conditions are only expected to deteriorate as the day progresses. But let me talk to you a little about the timing here because it is critical because Ian is expected to make landfall right around noon today. That is also the same time as high tide. And then you factor in all this rain locally, we could be looking at up to 12 inches of rain. And when, if all of that comes together, we could be looking at widespread flooding. Of course, power outages also a big concern. Hundreds of people already in the dark this morning. That number likely to increase. The governor of South Carolina has already issued an emergency declaration. However, stop short of mandatory evacuations, but encourage people to have a plan in place to get to higher ground if necessary. And also worth noting that if Hurricane Ian does make landfall later, Later on today, this would be the first hurricane since 2016. Hurricane Matthew was 2016. And, and yesterday, guys, I was out and about in the downtown area. This is low country for a reason. They are used to hurricanes in this area and flooding. So a lot of the businesses already boarded up. The sandbags are out. It appears this community is ready to ride out Hurricane Ian. All right, Kathy Park right there for us. Thank you, Kathy. Mm -hmm. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.